Hey, how you doing? I'm Greg Lumley and I'm going to show you a really cool trick uh, that works very well for copying auto white balances across in Lightroom. So I've done this shoot with Jamie and um, I use auto white balance and the auto white balance is amazing because a lot of the time it gets it right but every now and again because as you're changing your composition the white balance is going to change and of course the camera is auto white balancing of course. So as you can see uh, this image of Jay is amazing. I really like the skin tones on this image but the next one uh, which was a portrait shot is a much cooler look. Now that's obviously happening because of the shoulder over here bringing a lot more red in and again the camera is trying to compensate whereas with the wider shot the grey is bringing in a better white balance characteristics allowing the camera to actually calculate it in a better way. Uh, so now by rights I should be able to copy the settings from this image, the one that I prefer, uh, to the one that I'm like eh about. But that doesn't work and let me show you. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the uh, copy settings in Lightroom, that is a control shift and C, and that's going to bring up copy settings obviously. Uh, if, if you've got multiple things selected then what you might want to do is just go check none and click white balance and copy. Now I'm going to go to the image that I specifically want to drop these uh, white balance settings onto, I'm going to select that and I'm going to go control shift and V and nothing happens. That is because up in the white balance settings over here, it's on as shot. That is telling what essentially what Lightroom is doing is it's saying, don't worry about a custom white balance, just take what the camera gave you. So it's really easy to get around this. All that we actually have to do, we go up to the uh, white balance and I'm gonna go into the Kelvin setting here and you can either tweak it uh, over in the dial over here or I'm just gonna add a one over here. And you're going to see that suddenly it's gone from as shot to custom. Now I'm going to do the same thing again. Control Shift and C. That's going to copy. Copy white balance is selected. And I'm going to go to my next image and Control Shift and V. And you can see that it is now perfectly copied from one image to the next. So if ever you're coming across a bunch of images and you go, oh, that's such a nice white balance, I need to copy those settings across, that's all you've got to do. Just alter your original image that you want to copy from ever so slightly in the white balance, you won't even notice it, and that will allow you to basically copy over to the new image, because essentially it removes that as shot functionality. And there you go. Hope that was helpful to you.